today we will be doing the ferret toy of the month. Now this one is a great option. It is actually not expensive. So that's the good part about it. Lily just activated it, so it's dollar Emma. It's a really good option. It is a little mouse, so it kind of gives them the hunting instinct. It's meant for cats, but it's small, so it's a good ferret size. There isn't much ferret you can choke on. Of course, different ferrets are better or worse for chewing. It, whenever you touch it or move it around, it will make a noise like a mouse. It's very cute, even as a tail. There it goes. Curl the tape. Like that. Now, Lily. Let's see if she likes it. Lily, look at this. What? Okay. Do you want to play with it? Oh, there she goes. These ferrets really like toys like this, especially when it has sound, like this one does. I am afraid that it's going to run out of the sound. That's the battery, and I don't know what we're going to have to do with that. She threw it on me like crazy. So maybe this is more of a Melvin thing, but they've warmed up to it, and they seem to like it a lot, and it's one of their favorite toys to play with. My ferrets don't like toys as much as most ferrets. They're, you could say calm, but I wouldn't use those exact words. But um, they don't really seem to like toys as much as most ferrets. They mostly just like cuddling and food. So that's it. Um, it's really great, as I said, because it's from Dollarama. A lot of pet toys are super expensive, especially if you get one special for ferrets. But. Yeah, it's nice to find things at Dollar Room. There are lots of cute little toys at Dollar Room. There's one of the butterflies really cute. They have a lot of really good options for their kids because they need things that are smaller. Because if it's huge, they can't carry it around like they like to do and hide it in their tubes. So that's it. Thank you for watching.